Something that you want to do with Bard when the game literally just starts is you want to leave the base. This usually you want to try to do this if nothing is happening elsewhere in the map. So like if you feel like you don't want to invade, if you feel like enemies won't invade you, then it's much better to end up doing this. So what you do is that you walk from the fountain all the way up top lane. Top is your first lane that you want to go to. And what you do is that you unlock your W. So you get your W, you put it here, so where so your uh, top laner, if he ends up getting poked or anything bad happens, you can go back, grab the W. If you put it a bit too far, uh, the enemy, you might end up in the risky, uh, in the position that the enemy might take it for your top laner, and we don't really like that. Afterwards, what you do, after you're done with that, you see if your jungler is starting top side, so right, right here in the blue buff, you put it right there uh, to kind of help him. Uh, get the leash, you collect meeps if you see that there is any on the way uh, downtown, you put one for your mid laner, same idea here, uh, somewhere close to the turret, so they can not like go very far back and pick it, but get it, stay still in the range of minions and do their thing. Afterwards, same idea here, you put it for your jungler, and the thing is that, uh, I mean, of course, if you're starting here, same idea with top side if, you're start if the guys are in top side, and after you put it here, when the jungler will end up taking it, because, you know, you'll leash him and everything, and after he takes this, you'll have two, one top lane, one mid lane, and then with the third one, what you do is you put it in your lane for your carry. And then you proceed by uh, farming and farming. Because sure, Q level 1 can be very helpful. But the thing is that uh, it's not like it's going to make the biggest difference. And Bard will be able to hit level 2 regardless before anyone in the laning phase. If minions are even and the enemy is not pushing the wave too much. So you do this, you kind of help your laners out at the same time. And it's very helpful to uh, you know kind of make sure that you babysit them without really being there.